Hi, Shiv Bani here from Guitar Broadcast. In today's lesson, we're going to learn an intro and the complete song of People and Strange, the song by The Doors, Jim Morrison, iconic band from 1970s. This song has the most famous thing of its intro. It's a beautiful intro from the, from the guitar, Robbie Krieger. And uh, this intro, uh, a bit difficult as well. You know, it's a, Robbie has this kind of, uh, you know, finger style of some mixing them rock and roll of 1970s and Eastern music. And they, he did a very great job on a different song like The End, The People Strange and some like uh, Light My Fire. This lecture is going to be a bit different and I always try to make it more easy for you guys. So first in any riff or any intro, I will start with teaching you some that specific part which is the most difficult part of that riff. And then we start from that, uh, from the start of the riff and then breaking down the different pieces. So most difficult part of this uh, this uh, this uh, intro and riff is this this run three note run start from this E note from the, on the D string and then B note on the A string and then B flat and you play one two three one two three one two three one two three start like this one two three one two three so once you are done with this thing, this is the most difficult run and other things are easy. So let's start it from the beginning. Uh, song start from this, this P note on the A string and this three notes, B, A, G. This is, uh, this is the beginning three notes of this People in Strange riff. One, two, three. Now we get to the chord, chord part, chords part of the song, and this this intro comprises of three chords: E minor, A, and the B7 chord. So right after this three note, you go on the E minor. Simple. Let's do it again. Just simple E minor chord. 4 note ends with this open G 1, 2, 3, 4 let's do it slow like this and now comes the 3 note run which you practice already you see when you're done with the with the difficult parts, it becomes very easy because you know, okay, fine, this part is coming. So you, it's more easy and excitement for you. Then comes the A chord part. Simple three notes of the A chord, but end with the open G. And then get back to the same three note run. Let's do it slow. One, two, three, four, same run. In two, three, four, same run. If you're not familiar with the A chord, then I'll tell you this open A, then E note on the D string, and the A note on the G string. So let me do it from the start. Let me do it very slow again. If you're done with this thing, this is the most difficult part. The uh, rest of the song is very easy. After this, you go again on the A chord. You play three notes, but you for the fourth note, you go back on the chord, chord E minor shape, and then you play these two notes together, like B note on the A string and the E note on the, on the D string, like this. So, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Let me combine all of what we have learned so far. So it comes like this. Simple. And now, the rest of the song is very easy. It's only B, we, are, we are jumping to the B7 chord now. So now for open G and this hammer on from the on the A string, B flat to B. A. B flat B. 
Then after this, you quickly get into the B7 shape, this shape, this one, this is E major shape. If this is the E major, then you shift to up, upward string one, uh, every, every finger you shift to the up string like E major, most of you familiar with the E major chord, but if, if you shift one string up, then it will the B7 chord. So last of the song, like from G, hammer on, and then B7 chord, you play all three notes and this open E. Let me do it very slow. G, this hammer on, and this chord B7, open. ends with the same intro let me combine all the parts and let me play very slow after that we go to the chorus part of the song which comprises of this B7 chord D sharp on the D string, B note on the A string, A note on G string, B open, then the F sharp on the E string. Start with the venue strange, venue strange, faces come out of the rain on this D note. Then you go back to B7 again. Venue strange, venue strange, no one remembers your name. Then you go back to the here. This B7, when you strange and when you strain, it stays like this. And then after end of this thing, it goes back to same riff. I tried my level best to make it more simple and overcome those difficulties which I faced when I was learning to play guitar and these kind of famous riffs. So if you like this video, please subscribe to my channel for more upcoming videos.